Welcome to my kitchen. I'm Clara. I'm 93 years old. And today we are making meals from the Depression. I'm making peppers and eggs today. The recipe came from my mother many years ago. She would make it for lunch, put it in my, my bag, and I'd take it to high school. And then everybody wanted to trade lunch with me. One of the girls says, would you trade with me? I says, okay. So I gave her the lunch, the pepper and egg sandwich. She gave me a sandwich with spaghetti. <laughs> I was so disappointed. I says, never again. I'm not trading with anybody. First, you clean out the peppers, take out the seeds, and you slice them. I'm using three big peppers. I need a knife. We had the vegetables because my father would plant them all summer and then my mother would can a lot of stuff. So we, we ate pretty good during the Depression. All homemade stuff. I never used a cutting board. We didn't have all the conveniences of the cutting board and stuff. With the seeds, we dry them put them away, my father would plant them again. We'd have peppers for next year. And that's what we do with the seeds. Oh, it's cheap. We, because my father would plant the peppers in the yard, and so we had peppers. And then she would make peppers and eggs. So she'd have to just give the eggs. The peppers were there, everything else was there. I'm taking some oil and putting it where I'm going to fry the peppers. Well, enough to fry, but not too much. Putting salt in. When I was in high school, we'd bring the sandwiches in, in a paper bag. The bag would get awful oil. But everybody wanted our sandwiches. Everybody had a dry sandwich with salami or ham. We had peppers and eggs. And, you want to trade sandwiches? No, no, we don't want to trade. You have to wait a while now. I'm getting the eggs ready to put in. The peppers are soft. You put the eggs in. If you had your own chickens, then you have chicken and you have eggs, and that satisfied a lot of things. Everybody had chickens in their backyard. It would be a good idea to have your own garden, you have your own chickens, but I don't think that they would allow it anymore. When, yeah, when the peppers are soft, you put the eggs in. I'm putting the eggs in. And you mix them in there until they settle, and then they're done. Needs a little more salt.
Okay, everybody, the peppers are done. Can't have peppers and eggs without bread, so we're gonna make the bread.